Hello, I'm Brent Ferris from the Bitter Man Studios, and I'm here to teach you the next part of making our character. So we have our character.h. Let's create a new CPP file inside of our source files called character.cpp. In here, we are going to include, uh, open quotes, character.h. So now we can go ahead and start uh, making our functions. So character character. This is the constructor. We don't have anything we need to construct. Though I guess we, we can. Let's let's construct the character's uh, let's construct his health, set it to hundred. Um, and and uh, yeah. Let's get a, we need to also set a name for this character. Uh, so let's go back into our character H and say void set name so we have a setter and let's pass in a string n for name and let's go back and we have we are now um, going to have to make our destructor so character scope I spelled it wrong ah. uh, do our scope do our destructor character we're not going to destruct any. We have nothing to uh, kind of clean up at this moment. Um, and then we have a int get. Oh, sorry. Character scope get health. Uh, that can just return this health. We have void character damage int. Uh, amount. And we can go down here. Health. Uh, let's just say this. Health minus equals uh, amount. String. Character. Get name. And here we can just return this name. And void character. Set name. String in. And we can simply say ah, this name is equal to it. So there we go. We have constructed our character. Um, and uh, I want to make an operator. I want to, not an operator overload. I want to make an overload for this function. So let's go back to character. And let's say character string n so that we can make a constructor that passes in the character's name as well. Character, uh, character string n, and then we say this health is equal to 100, and this name is equal to n. That way we can set his name on construction if we need to. So there we go, we've created our class, and we've created, oops, we have created our header for it. Um, now we can test it out. So in our int main, um, let's type in uh, character c uh, equals, uh, let's just say character c equals character, oh, sorry, messed up there. Forgot that I need to do um, include character h up here at the top, otherwise we're going to get those errors over there. Um, so now we can say equals character, uh, let's pass in Bob, C out, and we're going to C out C dot get name, um, it's a function, put a colon, and C out his health, C dot get health, make sure that we have everything set up right, C in dot get uh, if you haven't used this, this just gets a return character and ends. It continues after you. it gets the return character. So if I press F5, we'll see Bob, and he has 100 health. Press Enter, and it goes away. So we have set up our character, and um, we're ready to derive a player out of him. So uh, see you in the next one.